Nanach Nachmanach Mumiman, the Kutim Aran, the gathering of Nanach Nachmanach Mumiman, Reishud Beis 2.12, this is the actual language. Zebachinas Machos, Kafu Kaf. This is an aspect of clapping. Because through clapping, one sees the picture of the Holy One. Because the picture of the Holy One, that is the imagination that we imagine Him. Rachum, Bachanun, merciful and gracious, Shakinuyim, and other adjectives, Vidimyoinois, and the correlations, Shanu Koyimoso, that we call, we title the Holy One. Kol Ilwa, Dimyoinois, Kiluanavim. All these imaginations and associations, the prophets reveal. Unavim, Zebachinus, Tibuat, Tila. And the prophets are an aspect of the words of prayer. Kimoniv, Svasayim. Because the word Navi, prophet, comes from the word Niv, Svasayim, the moving of the lips. Oshana Medabim, Bisfaseinu, and when we speak with our lips, as Atmunos, Vadimyonos, Mochaim, Bekapayim, when we speak with our lips, the pictures, the adjectives of the Lord, the Holy One, and we clap our hands, as in Iskayim, then there's a fulfillment of the verse. In the hands of the prophets, I will be imagined. So when we have the prophets, the aspect of speech, and we have our hands, so then we come to this imagination, to the words, the adjectives of the Holy One. Because the prophets are the speech, the words. And the hands are the hands of the prophets. The other dimion is so through this, the imagination is revealed. An aspect of in the hands, uh, in the hands of the prophets, I will be imagined. And there's a fulfillment of the verse that he will see the picture of the Holy One. Also the Clapping of the hands is an aspect of what it says in the prophet Hezko and the hands of man they had underneath their wings. The wings are are the speech, the words. Like it says in the Solicities and Kohelas that the master of the wings will speak. He'll say words. So you see that the wings are associated with speech. Also through clapping, the prayer is included in the Torah Shebachsav, the Torah Shebachsav, in the written and oral Torah. Shem Shnei Yadayim, which are the two hands, Yad Chosefes, Yad Chosem, the writing hand and the signing hand. The power of speech comes through tying, binding oneself to the righteous. Kemuva, Pe, Eskiriyas, Mesitra, Nisari. Like it is brought down, that the mouth, speech, is called from the side of the righteous one, the righteous person. 